Hello, welcome back to another video with Kiana Girl. I hope y'all are doing well. So, on the last episode of the Bedrock Server Series, we left off where I had uh, walked off a cliff and died. What I had meant to do was jump off the cliff and um, get to uh, not die uh, as I would be landing in the water, but... Uh, you can see I seriously miscalculated there, but that's okay. So we have the coordinates of where we're going. We have a bed, we have a boat, and we have two wooden swords, which should be enough to get us back to where we're going. So we're going to start heading in that direction, and hopefully we get there. You know what? It probably would not hurt to have a few berries uh, to heal up and uh, to have some food. So, why don't we collect a few of these, just so that we have something to nomch on, you know? Um, because we don't really have a food yet, as we're still on the way looking for a cherry grove biome, or a... Even a jungle biome, so that I can get the uh, watermelons would be nice. And a jungle biome has a very high possibility of finding a uh, lush cave underneath it. So that would also be pretty, pretty good. Um, but yeah, definitely, definitely looking for a cherry grove biome. So we're going to go off and I believe we were going in this direction. Um, was that the direction we were going in? Okay, so we want negative this way and this. Uh, this might not have been the direction we were going. Uh, it might have been. It's possible that it was. Oh, there's an emerald. I can't get that yet because I don't have a tool uh, to get it with. But, oh, yes, yes, yes. This way we're going because um, we went across that the house was there. So um, now how did we get across to that side is the question. That is the question of the day. I suppose it was probably easier to go across on that side. Um... But we're over here now, so we're going to have to figure it out. And we don't want to take too long figuring it out. Well, we're either going to make this or we're not. Woo! <laughs> okay. Well, uh, we made that. <laughs> I did not think that was going to go well at all. <laughs> so... Oh, jeez. So, I am trying to keep the videos roughly to the same length. Um, so, I know I've not been achieving that. Uh, I think the third video was about 20 minutes long. So, we will go ahead and try to keep the next couple of videos roughly around 20 minutes. Uh, and if the videos are too long, uh, I would greatly appreciate it if y'all would say, Hey, these videos are way too long. We don't enjoy that. Um... So that I, I know for future to not do that. Ooh. Yeah, I did want to avoid going through this. Because uh, I know... Okay, there should be a stone crossing over here that I took. Um, so that I could cross uh, over there. But hey, we can also go across over here too. That works, I guess... We don't need the stone crossing if we're already across. As long as we're going in the right direction. So, it looks like that... Oh, yes, there's the water. Very good, very good. This is good news. Yeah, I came out on the beach over there the last time. Now we're over here. So, we're going to jump in the boat. And I believe we go off in this direction. Yep, because we're going to go out 500 blocks this way. And then it should be 85 over there. So there is the spruce 
good. And then we're going to go off. There's like a little uh, waterway over this way. And we go around. And hopefully we will get there before my stuff despawns. Because I think if you're not within the area, it won't despawn. Um, so us being out here in the middle of nowhere and seeing that leather was a good thing. Uh, that means that it's highly probable that nothing has despawned yet because that leather is still floating in the ocean. And I'm pretty sure I'm the one that threw that leather out there. So that's a good sign that nothing has despawned yet. So we will remain ever hopeful that we will be able to get back to our stuff before anything happens to it. Looks like the sun is going down, so we're probably going to have to sleep. Uh, we did sleep once before heading out on this mission. Um, so we did get a little bit of sleep in, but probably going to have to do another sleep uh, before we get our stuff. Because that sun is fading fast, and we are not... We're not boating fast enough to get there. I wonder if I could boat all the way around where my stuff is. Um, I suppose the only way to find out is to try. Because, I th yeah, it must no, No, it was pretty far inland. I don't think I could boat all the way there. But I can get us really stinking close. Alright, the sun's not down yet, and I don't want to stop moving until I start getting closer. Um... So we'll just keep boating, boating on around, going. So the dogs are doing good. I just took them out. They've had their dinner. They're very happy and they're chilling out um, and doing, doing dog things. Uh, and I took them over to the, the dog park that's here at the truck stop, but they weren't all that keen on it. Ooh, lapis! <gasps> I could have picked that up with my stone pickaxe the other time. Oh well. What do you mean it's not night time? What are you talking about? It is night. The sun's down. Do I gotta wait until it's like halfway off the horizon to be able to go to sleep? That's stupid. That's stupid. It's night time. Let me sleep. The sun is down. Let me sleep. Thank you. Oh my gushness. Every second longer that it takes to sleep is a second longer that I am away from my stuff. And that guy's coming after me. I knew he was going to come after me, but that's all right. We're going to keep going. we just going to keep going. Spud, please don't do that. Your voice is very loud. Can we tone down, please? Thank you. You two go play together. And keep your voices down. Thank you. No, if you want up, then get up on the bed, bubbies. Ain't nobody gonna help you. You have you have the ability to get up on your own. I should probably eat, because look at that. My health went down. I forget you can eat while you're riding on the boat. Okay, so negative 500. So we want to go a little bit more this way. And... Negative 533. Okay, so if we go a little bit more this way, and then we're going to go back there. Then we will... Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Now we want to go straight this way, roughly. Yeah, because we are about still a thousand blocks out from my stuff. Okay. So we're just going to keep boating out this way, and then we should reach that platform of land. We will leave the boat behind because we have a boat. We had a boat on us. Um, yeah. We're going to keep going. Rolling. Rolling on a river. Woo! Okay, that's a good sign. That is the ruined portal that we found. That's a good sign that we are going in the right direction. See, there you go. You're up on the bed. You figured it out. Look at you being a big man and all. That wasn't so hard, was it, bubbies? Yeah, you figured out how to get up on the bed, huh? He's a big man, huh? Oh, maybe we could boat around. No. Yeah, that was, that was kind of deceiving. 
That was a little deceiving, but that's okay. That's a okay. All right. Now, pop on up. Leave the boat there. And we're going to hop on over. If we get over there pretty quickly, all of our stuff should still be there. There's that. Oh, the puppy is now an adult dog. Awesome. That is fabulous. Great news. That is great, great news. All right. So, I believe. Okay. Oh, we're still 200 blocks away. I should have kept the boat. But hey, what do I know? Should have kept the boat. What do I know? I don't know nothing. Alright, yes. We are almost there. We are very close now. Come on. Up and over this hill. That is where it is. Look at that. We might actually get back in time to save our stuff. I might lose a few things, but hopefully not the iron. That is a very important resource for an early gamer. Oh, look, a donkey. That's a pretty good resource as an early gamer as well. Okay, now we're not going to make the same stupid mistake we did. Alright. Oh, there we go. There is most of our stuff. Get the stuff that's farthest out first. Get all of this stuff. What do I need to throw out to get that? Oh, I need to put my shoes shirt on and I'm gonna lose something here I think I got all of it wow oh I'm gonna lose that if I don't do something um okay that's kind of important uh oh uh place down the bed place down the bed okay Awesome. Whew. All right. Um, let's see. Put that over there. That over there. That over there. That right there. That goes there. That goes there. And that there. Um, you know what? Why don't we leave... Uh, this behind and that in there okay we picked up that the only thing we're leaving behind is that and that is a okay okay good now we can continue on our way searching for a cherry blossom biome so that is wonderful news. I'm so glad that we were able to make it back to our stuff. And I'm so glad that I did watch my video back so that I was able to find out um, what the coordinates were for my death point. So that is, that is actually how I found my death point, guys. Uh, I did watch the video back and use that. Alright. That is... This might be worth exploring. Oh, you know what? We should probably put the extra bed over here so that when nighttime falls, we are capable of sleeping our way through the night and keeping ourselves safe. Okay, so it looks like there might be some exposed iron up here. 
This is one of the biomes I think that you can find exposed to iron up on the mountain. Um, how much coal do we have? 37. So we could we could stop to pick up a few more. I can't pick up that emerald, but that emerald does tell me that we are in the biome uh, that we can find the exposed iron at. So that is good news. We are going to be gathering just a little bit of this coal. Just, just enough. Alright, how much do we have now? 49? Okay. I'm trying not to gather too much. Because then what am I going to do with it? Although I suppose I could craft it into the blocks. But then, like, still, I wouldn't have anywhere to put it, so... Put that there. 57. I suppose I could count them as I'm gathering them. Oh, how many raw iron? Okay, so I have one solid iron and 28 raw iron. Yeah, that would have been a very, very big loss if I had lost any of those iron. So, I'm very, very grateful that- Whoa, that's lava. Is it just that little area, or is it more? I should be careful of that. I don't want to get burned. <laughs> Play with fire, wind up burned. Not something I'd like to do. Did I forget something? Is that why I have so much? I've got a crafting tool. Oh, I left that behind. Okay. That's alright. Oh! See, look at that. I told you. Exposed iron. And there's a llama over there. That's pretty cool. Ooh, look at that. Nice. Got us a couple more pieces of iron. I like that. And the sun is going down, so we're gonna stay vigilant for some more iron and vigilant to see what biomes we're coming up on. So I think today's video will be mostly a uh, exploring video and slash rescuing all of our stuff video. And then the next video, hopefully we will find where we're going to settle down at. And we will eventually be coming back to the spawn point um, once we get to where we're going and we get set up with some tools and stuff. I do want to leave this behind because I do not want to take up that extra inventory slot with something I could be using. We're leaving behind. So, alright, let's go upsie days. Upside. Up, 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 and away we go. Whoa. I don't think we're gonna find anything in today's video. So, I'm gonna have to continue in the next one. We're gonna keep going. We're at 18 and 45, so we're gonna keep going. Oh, look! These are the new doggies. Because the other ones had white and black. These ones are just white. Oh, man. So many different color variations of dogs. Oh, I'm so jelly. Oh, food. Nom, 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 Om nom nom. Oh, that's where all the storage space went to was I had extra berries because I thought I needed more berries. <sighs> oh well. That's okay. It's better to have more than to have not enough. You know? Look at the fox. See the fox so cute. We're going to keep going this way. Ooh, this is a mega taiga, isn't it? Because a mega taiga... <gasps> Do 
It's a black wolf. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Look at you. Oh, he's so cute. All right, guys. That's where we're going to leave today's video off at. Uh, because we are at 20 minutes and we're going to try and keep them roughly around the same. So y'all have a good one. Stay safe. And we will see you all in the next video.